Hello everyone, I'm Brandon with Lenovo and I'm here today with the ThinkPad T460. Today we are going to be replacing the memory module. This process will take about 10 minutes and it should be easy enough for anyone to do. The required tools will be a Phillips screwdriver and a non-metallic pry tool. Before we continue, we need to make sure that we are protected against electrostatic discharge or ESD. Make sure to shut down the computer and disconnect all cables and accessories from the system. For further information, watch our Understanding Electrostatic Discharge video by clicking the link in the description. And now that we're ready, let's get started. So the first thing we want to do is disable the internal battery. To do this, we're just going to disconnect the AC adapter, press the power button to turn the machine on, and then tap F1 to enter the BIOS. Once we're in the BIOS, we want to navigate to the configuration menu, down to the power selection and hit enter, and then down to disable built-in battery and press enter. Once you're in the setup confirmation menu, you want yes to be highlighted and then you're just going to press enter one more time and that will disable the internal battery. Next, we're going to remove the battery pack. To do this, we just need to move the switch marked with a one to the unlock position, then move the switch marked with a two to the unlock position, slide the pack out of the bay and remove it. Now we're going to loosen eight capture screws. Now that the screws are loose, we're going to use our non-metallic pry tool to pry open the edge of the system and then go around the system, releasing all the clips. Now we're going to disconnect the built-in battery cable from the system board. Next, we're going to remove the memory module. We just want to pull back the flap, press apart the clips, and then pull the module from the slot. Now we're going to place the module into the slot using the notch for alignment, and press down on the outside edges until the clips lock it into place. Next, we're going to connect the built-in battery cable to the system board. Now we're going to place the cover onto the system and press down around the edges until the clips lock into place. Now we're going to tighten eight captive screws. Now we're going to align the battery pack with the bay and slide it in until the switches lock into place. To enable the internal battery, we just need to plug in the AC adapter and turn on the computer. 